Hello everyone, this is Jens Papadopoulos from Beast in Black and you're listening to Metal Mixtape. Hi, this is Steve Grimmett, you're listening to the Metal Mixtape. This is Steve Zanzo Susan from Exodus and you're listening to the Metal Mixtape, so turn it up loud and start a mosh pit. And welcome to the Metal Mixtape, it's the boy, it's the Don DJ Ramo, this channel brings you interviews and reactions. And if you know the channel, you know we've been published all around the world. We've been on Blabbermouth, Metal Hammer, Loudwire, Metal Sucks, UltimateGuitar.com for interviews like Deathlock, Judas Priest, Megadeth, Trivia, Beast in Black, Sabaton. We've interviewed hundreds of bands on this show. And if you know the channel, you know we throw our own heavy metal festivals like Metal Metal Fest and Hollow Fest. And if you know the channel, you know I have been playing music, singing, and playing guitar for 20 years. But I am here, and you are here, and I am here because... I promised all you beautiful subscribers, all you beautiful music lovers, that I'm going to do more Maximum, The Hormones. So the songs we've already done is Hungry Pride and Alien, and both of those songs we did lyric breakdowns for, and Zetsubu, Billy, which I did not do a lyric breakdown for, which if you guys want me to go back and rewatch that video and do a lyric break, uh, breakdown, let me know and comment below. I usually don't redo videos, but since I didn't do a lyrical breakdown, it's hard to make sense of the song truly. Because when I did a lyric breakdown of Hungry Pride and Alien, I thought th I love the songs even more. Maximum of the Hormone are so amazing. You know what people are calling them in a lot of comment sections? They're calling them the Japanese system of a down. <laughs> I think I think uh, I can't compare Maximum of the Hormone to anybody the same way I can't compare System of a Down to anybody. They are both one of ones. They are both their own entities. And this band is amazing. Uh, Nao, uh, uh, Ryo, uh, Daisuke, and... Uh, Furoshi. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get better at my pronunciations of all the members of Maximum of the Hormone. So I'm going to do my best. So the song we're doing right now is Revenge Prep. I already have the lyrics brought up. So we're going to react to the video first. And then we're going to do the lyrics second. So, uh, but I want you guys to do, I want you guys to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys want to support the channel, there's a hundred thousand reactors out there. And the fact that you clicked on my face means the absolute world to me. Um, looking up these videos, I've seen that these videos have been reacted to a lot. So I know that these videos just have a lot to offer to everybody. So go support the other reactors. But most of all, go support Maximum, The Hormone. And actually, you know what? You know who you should support the most out of everybody over me, over Maximum, The, Hor over Maximum, the Hormone, over other people in general? You should take care of yourself. Take care of your mental health. Take care of your body. Love your family. Love your friends. Because without people who love music, the people who play music wouldn't be around to be able to share it as much as possible. So I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, share, donate, whatever you want to do. And also comment suggestions below. Here it is. Here it is Revenge Prep by Maximum the Hormone here on the Metal Mix Tape. また性格が離れは同じ位置同じ位置同じ位置見た目で決めつける奴らその重さも分からず早く軽く見下し何周もあってそこにたどり着いたかを想像することもできぬままずっと裏の裏は表だと信じ切ってる普通や一般と言った
Alright, I'm I'm about to say it. I'm literally about to say it. This is my favorite song by Maximum the Hormone. Hands down, my favorite song. This this song absolutely crushes Alien. This song crushes Hungry Pride. This song crushes Zetsubu Billy. This is beautiful. You wanna know okay, I'll be honestly, the first three songs, I loved them. I, I thought they were killer, but they didn't inspire me. They didn't inspire me. This song inspired me. This song inspired me to go to my band and show them Maximum the Hormone because I play in a metalcore band and and be like, dude, like I would love to do like transitions the way they do it, which is just incredible. And I love how everybody in the band sings. Um, they're beautiful. This band's awesome. I want to do another song almost similar to this, but there's a lot of singing. I love their screaming. I love their head banging. But Revenge Prep, this is my favorite song, hands down. Honestly, out of everything I've done of them so far, I need something. I need something to top this. So I want you guys to comment below and tell me what can top this. Now I gotta go read the lyrics. You guys ready for that lyric breakdown? Let's see the lyric breakdown. All right, let's do. Let's read the lyric breakdown. Let's see what it starts off. Okay, it says seventh grade now seventh grader. Uh, Ryu's mind already by week two is in a Koro Koro comic mode. Hitapi, um Manga Institute is the Bible wife. Help me, nobody can save me. Jeez, even big sis. Ah, uh, for example, if the weight, if the weight the scale needed pointed to was one hundred grams, going fully around would make 
1100 grams the same place the same place the same place because people that judge based on appearances without understanding that weight simply and indiscriminately look down on others as if they could imagine however many times it ended up going around i firmly believe there are two sides to every coin labels like regular or and ordinary for uh, abnormally normal people this is such a result of being tormented by such decent people's affairs um, of sanity even now still anger look motherfucker <laughs> the fangs are still sprouting shit let's go frustration go teen frustrations which have been possessed and encouraged by rock even now i'm sick of looking back school kills white paper indoor permed delinquent slamming the strings of a les paul said to be selling influence to fight with singers menaced by fighting hope in poverty it's about time the hatred of us weak people trembling and aching with pain which doesn't seem real counterattack now how about everyone go out of their way to kneel before us of repentance with your teeth rattling, <laughs> the sentence is assuming the position and having acorns and con. Let's see what this word is. Con pieto shoved down your pee hole. Ouch. <laughs> All right. Silence, talk, piss yourself, pathetic, ha, heaven and hell. Recite, spell, retweet. Pretty good. Let's push harder until you die. Riot, riot, riot. Now laugh, laugh, go fight, go fight, go fight, go fight. Now learn, learn, riot, riot, riot. Now laugh, laugh, go fight, go fight, go fight. Now learn, now learn. Yeah, now the reason we've come is to shut y'all up. However, with only a white belt, we got to throw down on your black belt and go home. <laughs> I like it. Ah, uh, shut it, stupid. Uh, sushi, damn, look at what you've done. All right. We're almost there. Yeah, because it's hard just living and getting over the resentment that's come our way. Still tinged in blood, this heart's murder desire wants to just go back to living. Okay, like this. Even some dumb 14-year-old would go and die, right? I honestly don't give a shit if I'm not even reaching anyone anymore. Money, too, can easily be worth nothing but shit. That's true. Then from here on out, life fucking just acknowledge those painful times seventh grade and younger reuse mine seventh grade younger uh right uh reuse mine okay man i like you know what they they just you know they talk about just ignore the how people judge you ignore how people put you down ignore how people just set these guidelines on how you're supposed to be happy because you know because we discriminate people all the time and and there's people that just want to put people down and look down on others. So this is why this song is one of my favorite songs. Yeah. Revenge Prep. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely awesome. There's no better Maximum the Hormone song right now. Um, I think the next song I might do is F for Frieza. Um, just because uh, I know Akari uh, uh, Toriyama just passed away uh, from Dragon Ball Z. Um, sorry if I mispronounced that. Um, I don't. I don't pre-rehearse reactions. I just do reactions straight from the heart. And I grew up on Dragon Ball Z. I don't know if you guys can see here, but uh, my background is actually a, a Goku. Um, let's see. My wallet is a Goku wallet. Uh, my car seats are actually Majin Vegeta. My uh, <laughs> my mouse pad is a big uh, uh, Vegeta God and a Vegeta Blue hybrid. Um, I have a Trunks poster over there of future Trunks with his sword. I grew up on Dragon Ball Z. I grew up on Dragon Ball. I grew up on Dragon Ball GT. I grew up on Super. Um, it's my fa it's my favorite anime ever. Uh, right now, my second favorite anime is One Piece. Um, I love Demon Slayer. Uh, Naruto is pretty awesome, too. There's a lot of great animes out there. I don't know. Is Pokemon an anime? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, no, Revenge Prep, Maximum the Hormone. We're going to keep doing these reactions. I appreciate you guys for supporting the channel. There's 100,000 reactors out there. <laughs> and the fact that you clicked on my face means you're a family. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. I'm DJ Don Randall. Thank you.